Hi, I'm Christina Medeiros with Geneva Center for Autism. In response to COVID-19, we've made a number of changes to our buildings. This video will take you through the safety measures we put in place to prepare our clients and our staff for their return to the center. All of our clients will be assigned to a cohort. You'll be informed in advance of your cohort and your designated arrival and departure window. When you come to 164, you'll see we have this fenced in area and this is where our clients will line up before being screened. We ask that you wear a mask according to the city bylaw if you're able to. We have pylons set up where you can maintain a safe distance while you're waiting to enter the building for screening. You'll make your way through the queue to the screening table and we'll take you through our verbal screening and additional measures. Prior to leaving your home, you will complete a pre-screening. If you answer no to all of the questions, you can make your way to the center. Once you arrive at the center, we ask that you wear a mask before entering, if you are able to according to the mask bylaws. When you arrive, someone will complete a verbal screening and once again, you'll have to answer no to all of the questions. You'll have your temperature taken with a touchless thermometer. And once you're cleared to enter, you'll sanitize your hands and anyone who needs support in doing so will get that support. And you'll be greeted by a staff member who will take you to your floor. Once in the building, you see we have floor decals throughout indicating where one would stand and maintain a safe distance while waiting to get to the elevator or stairwell. Once in the elevators, you'll see we have signs set up indicating where to stand, including facing the wall and no more than two people in the elevator at a time. 